gonna walk this over to Patrick's cage. Uh, now, before we walk over through our living room, uh, I should warn you, it looks like a crime scene investigation. This is because I am a scrapbook addict and I printed 900 pictures today, not an exaggeration. Don't judge me, all right? <laughs> listen, YouTube, listen, nobody judges people in YouTube comments, right? They're so friendly and nice all the time. I'll try not to focus on it. That's karma. You tripped because of karma just then. September 12th and then then this picture or these like photos are from the 13th and so on but then you have like larger photo series so for example this photo series this thick thick stack of photos um, is from the 23rd to the 25th, and it's from a trip. So these are not organized chronologically yet, even by a day. So when I get to this stack, it's gonna be a whole nother, it's gonna get messy again before it gets clean again. But I can't live like, well actually I can live like this, but my partner cannot live like this. And I will, I will show you the shame that he was giving me in a different video. I didn't put it in the final edit, but I'll put it in for this one. Okay, so, plan of attack. We gotta get this more organized so we can have a workspace that's functional and also viewable by me to view because I usually work facing this way. Stickers are collected. Into the bag of stickers. I told you I had a problem. Okay. You can get pro tip great deals on scrapbook stickers at the Dollar Tree.
Just doing a quick little chicken update. I finished one of the piles, moving on to the next one. Um, but before I do, I'm going to take a little snack break for my favorite 
uh, snack, not sponsored. Would love to be sponsored eventually if this channel gets big enough. Um, but I'm gonna have some chips ahoy and some milk. So I will catch back up with you uh, when I'm scrapbooking again. Okay, so that was a nice little break. Uh, and now we need to jump back in. Fall in. So, finished another stack, um, now I'm on to this one, so again, micro-organize, then tape. Um, I will say that the hardest part, I used to do all white paper, because it's cheaper, and then you just use stickers to add color and depth to your pages, but I was recently gifted um, paper because of my wedding, and so I switched to color, and that was like, oh my gosh, it's so pretty, so then I bought more, but it is taking so much more time because like every time I go to make a page, I have to like think about what color page is going to match with all of the pictures on the page, the stickers, the next page, you know, if it's like a front and back page or if it's only one side. It's a whole nother level of thinking. It's slowing me down. Um, but we're rolling with the punches, so let's cut to the chase. Welcome back to day three of me trying to scrapbook 900 pictures. I've got my tape, I've got my scissors, and let's cut to the chase. Okay, so I finished another pile. Moving on, keep chugging. I'm actually very happy with the progress I'm making. Mm -hmm. This pile here is going to go into a photo album. Um, so I didn't 
end up using you in my square I should clarify. Um, I don't know if I did this already, but I'm making scrapbooks, or sorry, I'm making a scrapbook for myself. Um, and then with the extra photos from like the people who are in them, I will mail them to them. Or I'll, if there's enough of them, make them a little photo album where you just like slide the photos in. So that's what I'm going to do with these pictures. And I think it's going to be a really special treat for a close friend. So, anyhow, so this is a separate project. Uh, I'm not sure if I'll film that, or maybe I'll film that separately. We'll see. Uh, but anyhow, I'm going to keep going. Jump back in. I totally forgot to uh, mention the next step in the process. So, we are now at the Mighty. We are a couple photos away that I might not even use away from the fat stack of photos. So we will be micro sorting by day and then micro sorting within day and then for this one, we have to split it into two photo album piles as well with the pictures we don't use because they are two uh, close loved ones that we are making photo albums for from this. So, this is going to be intense. Um, so, anyhow, okay. and I know you're thinking, uh, how many times did she get probably thinking to yourself, man, I hope she cuts it out. She better get some sharper jokes. That one was a little weak. I'm sorry, maybe I'll just cut it out. You either hate me right now or you love me. Intrigue. I shouldn't be like waving scissors around, but it's that intrigue that's gonna keep you watching. We were on the next trip, but we actually weren't. And thank goodness I micro organized first, and I had the sticky note method because I almost put the trip like two weeks early. So I know nobody cares, but then I would have had to like I would care, and then I would have to re scrapbook everything, like shifting it a couple pages, which would have sucked. It would have sucked.
four, I think, of scrapbooking, 900 photos. I'm sorry I didn't say goodbye to you last time, but for you it was like a millisecond, so it doesn't really matter. Um, so I'm just going to keep on trekking, keep on going. Um, I think I have my tools. Oh, so this is up here. Hold on. Um, so we are going to continue on our scrapbook journey. So let's just get to it. What's up? Can you scrapbook yourself to death? Uh-uh. If pictures were food and you had just gobbled all of the 900 up, then yes. But I think until then, no. again this is going to be the last day of scrapbooking 900 photos or more like 850 um, 
I already put the photos that I had set aside into photo albums, so I won't be, I didn't film it. I just, it was one of those like late night, I can't sleep, so I'm just gonna do this things. So those are in there. Um, and my goal for filming is just to finish putting the pictures on the pages. Um, I'm probably, well, I know I'm not filming the, uh, putting the stickers onto the pages because that's its own thing so maybe that's a video for another time uh, but for today I just want to finish actually putting in 900 or 850 uh, photos into my scrapbook and then I'll show you the thickness of my scrapbook and a couple like sample pages from it that feature my adorable hamsters and my hamsters alone so uh, yeah let's just uh, cut to the chase I have officially put all the pictures into the scrapbook and I even added a couple little stickers um, to some of the pages but I think that we're gonna call scrapbooking 900 pictures challenge done so let me show you my fat stack of scrapbook pages and then I'll show you a couple um, sample pages if you will. Um, they're not like fully stickered, they're not annotated, that's just a little bit like too too personal but I will show you some of the cute little pictures of our hamsters in our scrapbook. So. This here is our stack of scrapbook pages. Uh, I don't know how many it is. Um, and if it looks a little short for 900 photos, remember I did make photo albums, but also I try to use both sides of the paper when I can, um, just to you know reduce the amount of money I'm spending on scrapbooking, which is already an obnoxious amount. So I'm going to move the camera and then I will show you the first couple pages of our hamster pictures. So these are the first two pages of the scrapbook. Um, they feature our hamster Rocky. So I put in her name here and these are just cute pictures. And I picked pink pages because her flower that we got from the Dollar Tree, not sponsored, uh, is, you know, pink. And that's also from the Dollar Tree. Um, but as you can see, she's so cute. Um, look at her little eyes poking out, so adorable. Uh, and then this continues, and I have no other use for this baby page. It came as part of like a pack of scrapbook pages I bought, but I was like, 
I have my hamster babies so I can use this page for them. And then if you flip it over, uh, it becomes Butter's page, a couple pictures of Rocky, but Butter is the center piece here. Um, so of course I used Butter's name and these cute little butterfly sparkly stickers to carry on that little like babies theme having from before. Um, and it's because her Dollar Tree flower is yellow. And of course her name, Butter. So yellow pages for Butter. But then we have this page over here of Patch. Um, I would have given her a blue page, but it didn't match with my following page, which I'm not going to show you. So we stuck with pink for Patch, but I got her name cute and little like stickers. These, all the stickers you've seen so far are from the Dollar Tree, and these aren't even the best examples uh, of the stickers that they have. And I'm sorry that the camera's having trouble focusing. Um, but as you can see, that's her blue flower up there. So that is a couple of my pages. So that concludes the challenge. If you like this video, um, please hit uh, the like button. If you want to see more of my content, uh, usually I'm following the tutorials, but today was, or you know, these multiple days have been you watching me and I hope it's been relaxing uh, and satisfying. Um, but if you want to check out other content, please hit subscribe. Uh, comment below uh, where you get the best deals on scrapbook stickers or just to say hi. Um, and I'll respond. And then um, most importantly, I hope you have a wonderful day. And I apologize if the glare of my glass, I'm trying to like hide from the lamp. Like look, if I look this way, you don't see the glare. But uh, this is a very flattering or welcoming angle. But anyhow, like I said, I hope you have a wonderful day and I will see you next time. Bye.